Today, Precarious plays Pokemon Coliseum. And Showtime. Oh my gosh, indeed. I think we might be going right into the the boss. Remember how I said there's a boss in this level? Oh my god, look at those tappy feet at the top of the screen. They're tip tapping. What on earth are these? They're the They're creature delightful. that I, that's the final evolution of Lotad. Lulun Papa. Ah. Okay. That's. I don't want to bust up their party right now, but okay. Yep, that's what's happening. So this is show off. This is Mirror B. I believe the two woot. of you have met before. Oh my god, I haven't heard anyone say woot in such a long time. I think, I'm not sure if that's supposed to be taken so literally. Mm -hmm. I don't think he said, yeah, woot. It's probably more like, yeah, woo! <laughs> woo! Maybe. Woo! Woo, 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 woo! Yay! Stop! So, I <laughs> think this might be... Maybe. I, I recall this being one of the first really challenging battles in Pokemon Coliseum. Because I think he employs like an actual theme, like a build. Oh no. Ooh, that runs a parallel to this hot beat. This theme, this yeah. build. This sweet disco build that he's got going on under that yellow spandex type <laughs> suit. Well, this is unfortunate. I thought we were going to have a little more time to train up yeah. a couple of those Pokemon. I'm not really completely sure what to do about this. Okay, so Lud Ludicolo is a is grass, grass water Pokemon. So Meditate is a fighting psychic. psychic. So, can high jump kit? No, my recommendation is going to be to use Calm Mind. Check the PP on Calm Mind. Use that until either you have to take a break to quaff a potion, mm -hmm. have meditate, administer a potion, I should say, to meditate. Mm -hmm. Use that until you have to do that, or until you've used it six consecutive times. And the easiest way to keep track of that right now is to just, whenever that gets to 14. Okay. Now, what does Calm Mind do? Hold on, wait a second. 20, 19, 18, 17. Wait. Oh my god, hold on. I'm suddenly like so worried about math. Whenever you use it, it will drop to 19, then it will drop to 18, then 17, yeah. then 16, then 15, then 14. Suddenly I was just so worried that I just like screwed up basic, really basic like math. Yeah. Math. Okay. All right. Calm Mind, it increases both your special attack and your special defense by one stage. Mm -hmm. What's important about that right now is the special defense half. Because mm -hmm. grass and water moves were exclusively special attacks in this generation. So unless they have like a normal attack or something kicking mm -hmm. around in their arsenal, if you boost your special defense high enough, you'll become effectively immune to their their attacks. Cool. Yeah. Now he should Sonic Boom or switch out? I would recommend that he stay in because he will be, I think, four times resistant to any grass moves they yeah. have. Mm -hmm. You should probably have him use Super Sonic on one of them mm -hmm. and then start Sonic Booming the other one in subsequent turns. The thing about Ludicolo is it's going to use Rain Dance and I believe they both benefit from an ability they have passively called uh, Rain Dish, mm -hmm. which will restore a portion of their HP every turn. Mm. It also does other things, Rain Dance. Mm -hmm. um, it's sort of gnarly. This is why I told you to leave Quilava and Slugma in the box. Did you actually manage, did the confusion take hold? Uh, no. Well, that's fine. That actually did more damage than I thought it was going to. Mm-hmm. Ooh. Well, that's fine. Yeah. I think, I don't know. How many of these does he have? Damn it. 
I think he has five. Ugh. And remember how I said, as long as he, doesn't, as he doesn't have a normal move in his arsenal, it should be fine? There's that normal move. They're right away <laughs> with the fury swiping. Go ahead and switch strategies and just have Meditate use something like high jump kick. Okay. Um, and just have Yanma keep Sonic booming. That yeah. one. I'm gonna have everybody attack that one. Hmm, I think... This is a very challenging scenario compared to the ones that we've been put in up until this point. Yeah. Because he is fighting with several fully evolved Pokemon. Yeah. And right now, you actually don't have the ability to have very many fully evolved Pokemon on account of your, your not having access to the... Um, Forest of Time or Forest of Rebirth. I can't remember the. There's a shrine. There's a, a shrine with a Pokemon that will help you. Don't. Oh, yeah. Let's go. Yeah, I didn't want to waste both attacks on the same one. Yeah. It, it's just the high jump kick is the stronger of the two, and I thought that you. Even just dividing their attacks up separately, but then having. Sonic Boom be focused on the stronger of the two, the healthier of the two, would have been a mistake, and I'm glad that you didn't, didn't yeah. go that way. Yeah, I don't like to waste damage. Gosh, when I catch it, I catch it, yo. <laughs> well, this is, uh... This is going much better than I anticipated. Oh, don't say that. It's too early. <laughs> See, there's the rain dish effect. Hmm. High jump kick. This guy. Fight. Sonic boom. I think I'll do the same dude. Yes. Because maybe we can get him in this turn. As long as high, com and the <laughs> high jump kick doesn't miss. That was the healthier of the two? Who did it target? Meditate. Okay. That means you're going to want to switch Meditate out. Okay. Leech seed is a move that doesn't deal damage directly the turn it's used. Mm -hmm. It's one of those tagless status effects. It's going to drain a portion of Meditite's HP and give it to that particular Ludicolo. Mm -hmm. And it was the healthier of the two, so it's going to happen. Yeah, but you see what's happening, right? Check, check this out, because he's going to... Get health from Leech Seed, and yeah. then if he had been damaged, yeah. he would have gotten additional health from Rain Dance. Actually, I guess maybe Rain Dance expired. Regardless, you should switch Meditite out. Okay. I mm. think that. Who should we swap for? Probably Swablu, just because it has the resistances and it could use yeah. the. Being, it could benefit from being exposed to battle. Yeah. Even if you wind up just having it Shadow Rush a couple of times before switching out for Espeon. Should I use... Should, should I keep Yanma, Yanma, you should Sonic have, Booming? You should have Yanma... Go ahead and have Yanma use Shadow Rush and see what it does to the level 31 Ludicolo. Okay. Because that one definitely has Leech Seed and it's not, not cool. No, not cool. Leech it's, Seed, not cool. It's possible to wind up with... A Ludicolo and other Pokemon, but Ludicolo is the one that's, you know, on the screen. Mm, that's okay. Uh, it's possible to have a Ludicolo that regenerates a lot of HP every mm -hmm. turn because it can have Rain Dish. Yeah. If it, it holds an item like Leftovers, mm -hmm. it will restore some of its HP. Mm -hmm. And I believe it can learn... Ingrain, and I think that there's a water one as well. I can't remember what it's called. It's not water sport. Mm-hmm. Yes, I think that that weakens the power of fire moves. What is it that makes Yanma speed up every turn? It's passive ability. It's um speed boost, I think is just what it's called. Mm -hmm. 
Oh, Swablu, tough man. Oh, oh, Yanma, tough man. Maybe this is a shitty attack. <laughs> I know that. Well, they're just both resistant to it. That's the thing. That's and now, wonderful. now I'm gonna have to switch out Yanma. Yeah, probably for Espeon. Okay. The dream, the goal was to enter this battle after several additional battles with a Swablu and a Noctowl that were um, powered up. But yeah, but had more moves unlocked. That did not happen. Oh. But okay. you, you can imagine, right, how awful it would be if these guys were restoring like half of their HP total, half of their maximum HP every turn. Yes. From Leech Seed Shoot. Ingrain. What? I just forgot to call Swablu. I almost did, anyway. But you can imagine, like, Rain Dish plus Leftovers plus Leech Seed plus Ingrain. Plus whatever that water move is that I cannot remember. Maybe I'm, maybe I'm making it up. Maybe I was just thinking of Ingrain. Mm-hmm. Well, if there is such a move, Fail will have put it on screen ages ago. So let's move on. Mm-hmm. There's something that I wanted to, to bring up, and it's unfortunate because I think that we spoke about it a little bit while we weren't recording. Mm-hmm. And you can just, now you can just alternate between Noctowl and Swablu Perfect. whenever they get leech seated. Okay. Um, oh, asshole. Sorry, I'm getting grouchy. The point of this game this game has a point, and I'm worried that we may have talked about it on the show, but there's something that I know that we didn't that I'm going to add to it. Um, confusion is probably the best way to go. Just kill it with confusion. Mm -hmm. Because its attacks don't count as physical, which is why Reflect is no good right now. No good. Yeah, you would need Light Screen. Mm. Or to resist Razor Leaf, anyway. Ah. Keep ah. an eye on the damage that it deals to Espeon, because it's not going to resist it. Okay. Yeah, that's see, that's, still that's not pretty too respectable. Bad. Yeah. Considering it hits both people. It's yeah. no surf, but. You know. Well, yeah. We can't all be like surf. Yeah. Damn, though. Surf. Damn, though. He's so confused. Damn it. <laughs> Fucking ass. That. That's the way. That's the way to do it. So he there. just dove underwater? Yeah, which it's uh, it's dig, but water based. So now he's he can't be targeted, which means this has the potential, if I were on the other side of this. You would stomp me. Because it is just the most obnoxious stall build. If he were to throw like a couple instances of toxic in here, yeah. maybe a protect, just in case somebody had, I think surf, I think surf bypasses world, uh, dive. I think surf deals damage to targets that are diving, just like God. earthquake, earthquake and magnitude. Just like Earthquake and Magnitude deal damage to targets that are digging. Mm hmm So just to have Protect in there to still be able to wait people out. Ugh. Fury. You need to have Swablu and Espeon combine their might and beat the level 31 Ludicolo. Okay. Should I... Get an item? Should I no, just, just do that fight. thing I said? Yeah, it is very important now that we know that he has dive and they collectively have rain dance, like just as a team. Mm -hmm. They've got a lot of fucking bullshit, and he needs to take care of this. It's just before... when you said combine their might, there are many ways to bring might down on others. God damn fucking sorry, I'm right. rain dance, stupid. Fortunately, the AI is really dopey. Uh huh. So they both just use their turn to do the same thing, you know? Yeah. Okay. Let's have Swablu use Shadow Rush anyway. Okay. Just confuse the shit out of this guy. Come on, we need him gone. And if it lives through this turn, then you can just recall it and take care of that hyper mode situation mm -hmm. in, a, in a later battle. Yeah. Oh. 
That was actually probably the stupidest use of its, what may be its last move. Yep. Oh, thank goodness. So when a Pokemon uses Leech Seed, after it dies, Leech Seed goes out of effect, correct? I am suddenly not sure. Okay. I don't know. It's something that I should know because I ran a very particular jump luff build. Uh -huh. <laughs> that had it had leech seed, substitute, sleep powder, and I think aerial ace. Oh, who's this fellow? <gasps> oh, oh. Ours now. Oh no. Okay. This this just brings a whole nother level of intensity. <laughs> it's cute because he still dances. Yeah, he does. <laughs> As okay. What type of Pokemon do you think Pseudo Wudo is? Uh, oh, I know the answer to this. <laughs> I think he's a rock Pokemon. Yes. <laughs> yes. But I cheated because I already knew that. Okay, so Noctowl. Pseudo Wudo might knock it out with a rock move. Fuck. Flaffy could paralyze it though. Okay, let's try Flaffy. The only bad thing is that it might have. Um, a um, ground move hidden somewhere. Okay. Well. Then it's worth it's worth trying. Just as long as Flappy gets a uh, gets the paralyze in, it should be fine. Okay. Should I be worried about Espeon? Espeon is our noble fighter warrior, and um, lethal lads and lasses allows room for such noble sacrifice. We're not playing a Nuzlocke. It's okay if. <laughs> uh, Espeon gets knocked out for the, the greater good. Okay. Ah, oh, Flaffy Laffy! Get him! Oh, sweet. <laughs> <laughs> Such a good glare. No, that's a different move. Oh, that's Named right. glare. Oh my god! What did he use? I'm, shocked. I'm not sure if he used takedown or if he used uh, shadow rush or uh, I don't know what he used. Oh no, knockdown no. Oh, knockdown will probably get wrecked. Metatype may be the way to go because if it has any rock moves, it will at least resist them. The problem is you won't be able to use high jump kick because if you do, it will almost definitely knock it out. Uh, okay, well. I'm going to use Metatite and not use High Jump Kick on Sudowoodoo. You can High Jump... High, man, that is really difficult to say consistently for me. High Jump Kick. You should be able to do that to Ludicolo. Yes. That should be just fine. I keep trying to say, like, at one point earlier I almost slipped and said uh, High Junk Kick. <laughs> That would She's be a very different dramatic. technique. Um, hmm. What's the one that paralyzes? Thunder Wave paralyzes. Thundershock deals damage. Okay. I want to try to paralyze Sudowoodo. Is that going to be very bad? No, that should be fine. Okay. That's actually why we put Flaffy out. I don't know That's how. That's what I thought, but the thing is that when words are similar, when the names of attacks are a little similar, mm -hmm. it gets difficult for me to remember which one's which, especially when I'm, like, sweating it. <laughs> oh, boy, this is gonna be great. This is gonna be great. It's gonna be okay. So, we're gonna have a cool Sudowoodo. There is a point to Pokemon Coliseum. Pokemon Coliseum was introduced on the GameCube, and it was intended to be used alongside the Game Boy Advance GameCube link cable mm -hmm. to allow Pokemon from Generation 2, which at that point were still restricted to the original Game Boy entries, mm -hmm. Game Boy and Game Boy Color. If you use Thunder Wave on Ludicolo, mm -hmm. you can then have Metatite either switch out or you can have Metatite you should probably use a potion on Metatite to try to keep it alive. Okay, sounds like a plan. Um, so, they were introduced, or Pokemon Coliseum was introduced to allow Pokemon from gold and silver 
type of potion to be used um, in the Game Boy Advance titles. Mm -hmm. Pokemon has a this weird reoccurring element in its history where they have to. Well, they don't have to, but they they wind up introducing new products. Damn it! Is he using rollout? Rollout doesn't cause recoil. Why is that so much damage? Is it just takedown? I have not been paying enough attention to Pseudo Wudu, clearly, because I don't know what move it used. What move did it use? Tell me. I don't. Poke Master. No. And why is Ludicolo still alive? Did you miss? I. It says that it was already paralyzed. You use Thunder Wave and it's not, not Thunder Shock. Did I tell you Thunder Wave? I, don't I shouldn't know have now. to. Use the damaging one. This is exactly God, I can't the wait. problem I was I can't wait until you, you until you get Thunderbolt because oh, there's no God. way that you can you can confuse a wave and a bolt. Like I can understand like a little shock in a wave. Should I just switch Meditate out? Yeah, after that I think so. Ooh, Noctowl, I guess. Sure, Noctowl. Why not? I don't know what move it used, so is as good a guess as any. Sorry if it was a rock move, Noctowl. That's a problem it's taken care of, at least. Yes. Oh, don't be so dramatic, Ludicolo. Get back in the bowl. Look at his hat. He's nothing but drama. Low kick? That was that's, that's it? But is that what he used before? I I think so. No, no. He's supposed to be paralyzed. He needs to stop it. Well, actually, I guess that makes sense because the low kick is a fighting move, so it wouldn't have done. Um, yes, that's fine. Low kick. Uh... Would have done normal damage to. No. Because it's a fighting move, and psychic types resist fighting moves. I don't know what this uh, pseudo voodoo is about. It's a bunch of nonsense. He's very strong, and now he's yellow, and now I'm gonna start throwing pokeballs at him. And he's paralyzed. I would continue using Flappy to thunder shock. Mm -hmm. I apologize deeply if I said thunder wave before. Well, and I apologize deeply if I heard Thunder Wave before somehow. So continue to use Thunder Shock and use Knocked Out to throw Pokeballs. Yes. I will say that at this point you should have known. I... Should have, you should have known. You should have been like, no, you stupid half-bird-brained asshole. How dare you tell me to Thunder Wave a paralyzed Pokemon wasting my time. That redundant bullshit. That's what you should have said. In exactly that I'm, tone. I'm worried about hurting Pseudo Wudo too much. Then you should have uh, Flappy use Cotton Spore and just throw Pokeballs with Knockdown. Because Cotton Spore is non damaging. Okay. Oh my gosh, we are in the home stretch of this. Come on. This anyway. is like one of my favorite Pokemon because it's so funny to me. <laughs> so funny. <laughs> yeah, he does. Yes! Yay! Oh, that was harrowing. I'm sorry about the things that I didn't remember and the stuff that I did maybe, that I should have done. Maybe you didn't remember. Maybe. Well, no, d I guess definitely, definitely didn't, didn't remember, remember, but maybe misheard, so I okay. may have not helped. I apologize for maybe not helping. Okay. There, everyone's Deal. sorry. Everyone's Mirabi is sorry. The only person that isn't sorry is probably Pseudo Wudu and most of Mirabi's Ludicolo because they just love to dance and there's no shame in that. <laughs> Yeah. Now, how did this happen? This is a real power move <laughs> on, on the protagonist's part, you know? Yeah. Like, yeah, we won that platform. That's ours now. Get off. <laughs> King of the hill! 